Greetings and salutations, relaxed gamer nation, and welcome back to Space Engineers Multiplay Survival on uh, Pertam using the Industrial Overhaul mod. So this video is a little strange in the fact where after this I'm going to be tossing in a bunch of uh, um, uh, time lapse stuff because there was a slight uh, technical issue. <laughs> With the last video, as in it was not recording Bane's voice. So, that's kind of sucky. So, I, I'm hoping it's recording his voice now as his arm flies off into nowhere. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Hopefully that's, that's recording. Okay. It, it, yeah. it should be recording this track. I double checked everything, so let's see how it goes. <laughs> Well, not my fault. <laughs> no, not your fault. So, we did a bunch of stuff, uh, mainly scouting and fixing up the base a bit here. Uh, Vane added in a sorter system to drain stuff from his rover. And uh, through this hinge, we modified the rover quite decently. It's got a gun on top of it now. It's one of the laser guns because we actually had the material to do it. Um, and we did a whole bunch of scouting and went over to the Pilgrim. Where are you? And salvaged a bunch of stuff from there, which I can't find the Pilgrim right now. Did we take down the antenna? Uh, no. I don't think so. I am not seeing it on the on the on the map here. Oh, I guess we. But it oh, was... we shut off the power. Oh yeah, what was it close to? It was close to the bauxite, right? Yeah, real. It was the next to one. Okay, so six point four the bauxite. kilometers away, and I didn't take a. Take a GPS because I was a dumb dumb. <laughs> well, the box site, I think the box site was right next to it. Yeah, I think so. I think, I think so. Um, so there's a bunch of stuff we can go take a look at to do a little bit of salvaging because we actually rolled over there with the rover. So, yeah, 6.4 kilometers is too bad. And I built this little scout plane that uh, that actually flew relatively well. Hmm. It doesn't have guns, but it's, it's a scout plane. It's not supposed to have guns. I guess I could put guns on it, but scout plane. <laughs> Why isn't it? Did you oh. set up the buttons yet, or? I know what the problem is. It's because of the small uh, con cargo container. It, the small one is full. Oh. So, I guess we need more small cargo containers. It's not. It's not. What the f... What's the problem then? <laughs> um, are your sorters going through another set of sorters? They shouldn't. But I'm gonna double check. Because this cargo container is built into a sorter system, right? And it's currently on red, which I'm not sure what that yeah, means. It shut them off uh, right now. I, I'm doing it manually. The button is not set up yet. Ah. So, yeah. Uh, a lot happened. Um, I'm going to quickly cut to the... Uh, to, uh, condensed version of the three hours that we played and didn't record Bane's voice. And I'll see you in a moment. Whee! <laughs> and welcome back. I hope you like that little that time lapse. I have no idea how it's going to turn out. But I hope it turned out decently. <laughs> we will uh, see. Yeah, I will, we will all see, actually. 
Oh, what the heck is that? That's a weird sound. Um, we found titanium, or at least I did on, uh, on doing a little bit of exploration. I just don't remember where it is now. It's to the right, ah, behind yes. the mountain. Uh, so you'll want to veer off, t you'll have to, um, yeah, turn around and go around this mountain, unless you can climb the mountain, you might be able to. Or I'm gonna check around this side. Because it's a long ways on the left, and there is a large cliff over there. Oh. Well, I'm gonna try to climb a bit. Usually I have no problem seeing you here. It's a and fairly large vehicle. <laughs> That's what's scary. Double split? Yeah. Oh, there you are. I need to go the other way. Yeah. Turn around and go to the... Um, follow me. <laughs> if you can see me. Uh, nope. I'm off to your right. I see you. Should I go that way? There's a... Uh, a Canyon or something like that over here. Oh, what is that? Oh, I see things. There's a settlement or some of some sort over here. And I found lithium. Again. It doesn't look like it's an armed settlement. Powered. And it doesn't have a beacon. No, it doesn't. It's been a pretty good location. Oh. That was it. Are you firing something? Yeah, my gun is firing at the... At the base. <laughs> I need to shut it off. There we go. It started firing on the wind turbine. Is this? That's a hangar. It is. Worth <laughs> wow. There's a large atmospheric thruster over here. Almost completely full of stuff, including 57 titanium plates. Okay, I can't open the gate. You see anything? So this gate doesn't have any power. This door had power. Doesn't look like there's any defenses in there. I don't trust it anyway.
Yes, it is. Ow. See it. Not the one. Is there another Completed one? Destroyed. Oh, there's another one. I'm gonna make it easier for us to move. Where is it? It's to the left on the left side of the door. Same height as the other one. Destroyed. Oh. Oh, it's connected last way. That's charging batteries, refueling hydrogen. Detach refueling port. Charge batteries, detach fueling port. Let's see, control panel. Is it on? It's Everything on. is existing. How do I get control of this one? Uh, you probably have to grind down the both cockpits, or at least get them down to a certain location, or below the hack line. Yeah. I could get into one, but I need to access everything on that vehicle. Like a little Doom Maybe. Rover. Yes, with a system that shakes damage. Whoa. Hold on a second. Uh, that work? Oh, I might have to access. The, okay, hold on. It should have. Hinge part? No. Not the. Fueling board. Yeah, but you're attached. Attached charging batteries, defueling hydrogen. Hinge lock, safety detach. Detach. Here. Detach. Just detach. Like this. It's detached now. Ah. Offline. Uh, well, batteries? Oh, I can't access them. There are one, two, three, four batteries that I can't access. How do I take this over? Did we have I think we gotta to... tear down the majority of every, like... There's a hydrogen engine here. Because I think I have easy, um, easy capture on them. I'm, I'm not sure. It'd be good if we had it. No, still no access to there. I can access that one. Is there fuel in the hydrogen engine? There is. Yes. A small tank, but I can't access the batteries. But they have two programmer blocks. Where are they? Because this vehicle would be nice to have. To be fair. What's in this?
Uh, oh, the batteries are in the front. Oh. And they have lithium power cells, so we can actually just grind them down to hack point. The two batteries are under control now. We don't have any super connectors on us, do us, do we? Because we have a thing called the hacking computer. And it requires 10 superconductors, a bunch of basic computers. And a large area of space. Steel plates. I don't have any steel plates on. But we have steel plates nearby. Okay, so we need super connectors for this. I could probably fly back to base and grab something. Unless you can find super conductors nearby. That is true. Think like I said, I have a hacking computer that I have on it right now, but it needs bits. Oh! Who the hell is the base? Long as really. <laughs> Yeah, but I got a, I got a flyer, so I can get there with it. Eight kilometers. Why is there a warhead on the end of my... Really? Really, Atomic? Really? What? You put a piece of a warhead on, on the front of my... little scout plane? <laughs> okay, I have all the parts for that hacking computer, so let's go do that. Is there a separate, separate size for a larger hacking computer, or is it the same stuff? Same stuff. <laughs> On my way back to Vane, or back to the outpost. Which I don't think I have the GPS for. You should have it. Yeah, it might be in my system. I gotta land. So I don't crash. Post found. So Vane's back, I mean, not Vane. Atomic's back. He's going to be busy building something, I think. So we'll check back on him in a bit. Once I get this hacking computer set up. I am going to fly back to the outpost and I will bring you guys back in a moment.
Alrighty, so I made it back to the outpost here and plopped on this hacking computer, but I think it's not going to work because I don't have scripts enabled. Which kind of sucks. I should really do that. I'll have to do that in the next load. Maybe I'll remember. Maybe after this recording session I'll pop back in and just flip it on. Limited power. Go turn off the plane and join Vane in the buggy. Assuming yeah. I have enough power for it. Right now I'm trying to build my way up from the titanium. Build your way up? Well, did you dig straight down or something? or? Kinda. I got tired of trying to find a way down, so I think thought that it was be faster to dig straight down and then dig up. Gotcha. So this has hydrogen as well. Sometimes it's just fun to drive a buggy. <laughs> it around a lot. Hmm? <laughs> the buggy jumping around a lot. That's what I think is fun. Yeah. And this is gonna take a while. I have the power. We're going to lag these sessions, so. Probably because we're so far apart from each other? No. Welders. Welders, oh. Did you build a whole bunch of welders? About to. Okay. Sounds like a sandstorm up here. Well, a sandstorm's not too bad. It's when you get into the electrical storms where it gets bad. <laughs> that was a little uh, clenching. <laughs> when you're going 44 meters per second in a four wheel buggy. Yeah. <laughs> does it have a gyro? Yes, it does. <laughs> Thankfully. <laughs> but I think I gotta drop the wheels down a little bit. <laughs> the strength. So that my landings are a little smoother. Oh, I see. So, uh, nifty. It's got front wheel propulsion or rear wheel drive, or you can have it set up to do one or the other. Nice. That's cool. You charging the batteries or just running the engine? Uh, we're just running the engine so the batteries doesn't drain. Gonna use the batteries to move the vehicle later. Oh crap! Oh, it's shooting your vehicle. Yep. I'm tr I'm gonna. Is it completely destroyed or? No. Not completely. 
Is it workable? Yeah, it's workable. <laughs> right. uh, Why did it just decide close. to shoot when I got close to you? That's. I don't know, but we have some spare parts at least. <laughs> some. <laughs> Buggy cock cockpit is damaged. Well, it uh, it almost got split in two. <laughs> well, it's not that bad. And how to draw ten displays and ten aluminum. Not functional yet. <laughs> Damn. Need displays. I got a few displays around this thing that I can. So nothing too important was damaged, at least. Uh, hydrogen engine got almost destroyed. Oh, great! I well, I don't have the batteries. For that. The batteries are so decent. Yeah. Well, at least now we know that that one is kind of dangerous. Yeah. There's a programming yeah, block on here, which I can probably get rid of. Get me some displays. <laughs> well, while it's open. <laughs> Need five more displays. I don't have any displays at all. Well, at least you can drive it. Uh, when I get the buggy cockpit up and running, I can. Well, you can. Six oh, out of ten. Right. I need four more displays. <laughs> oh, there's some displays on the top here. Oh, from the other one? <laughs> they got blown up? <laughs> Probably not enough. I need... Two more displays. Uh, oh, there's another program sorry. block here. So give me one more display. Oh, and this will give me another display. Awesome, it's drivable now. <clears throat> <laughs> Wrong cockpit, but it's drivable now. <laughs> well, we can salvage that, Pikey. <laughs> If we make I can drive a hinge, it. if we make a hinge back here, I can <laughs> use that bug as a <laughs> trailer <laughs> back. <laughs> True. We probably have parts for a hinge, but I think it should be fine. Might want to reinforce a few areas though. <laughs> Let's see. Basic computer, large steel tube. Yes, we have parts for it. <laughs> I'm gonna make a one for safety. Uh, I am reinforcing the side of my buggy. So that if the buggy cockpit gets taken out, which hopefully it shouldn't. No, that's synthetic fiber, don't need that. Or steel plate. In the wrong cockpit. I had too many cockpits anyway. <laughs> uh, well, <laughs> maybe need to. <laughs> oh, my goodness. It's funny, it didn't do that until I got into the buggy. Into the buggy again. It's like, uh, yeah. I see you have a buggy. Uh, <laughs> so you like to keep the buggy, right? Well, I'm gonna shoot it for you. How's that? Uh, you like it? No, not really. Not well, too bad. <laughs> well, it was kind of funny. I was getting up out of the hole, see the beam just shooting at something. <laughs> Some more scrap metal. 
Uh, the hacking computer got destroyed, which is really funny because it shouldn't have. <laughs> okay, so how do you loot your body? You point at it and you... Yeah, but like, there, whenever I press F on it, nothing comes up. The uh, change the inventory slot to see the inventory of kit. Interacted item. Change it to the helmet icon. <laughs> yeah, helmet icon. Just in case you're off the helmet icon. There we go. That's what do you, mean, what do you mean by that? Well, when you're uh, in your inventory, there is a helmet icon and then there's a, a, a little box icon. Oh. Okay. Do that, yeah, my bad. Yeah. <clears throat> I, I get hit by that every once in a while myself. I always get hit by that. <laughs> you taught me that it's that that doesn't make me look it. <laughs> yeah. Um, well, I think a hydrogen tank was there at one point. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you have one left. <laughs> well, it does me no good until I get this hydrogen engine up and running. And it needs electromagnetic, yeah. Yeah, electromagnets and copper, and I don't think I have any of that stuff. But in worst, worst case scenario, oh, I do. we can all... Okay, cool. I did have parts. Cockpit was on the wrong side anyway. No, it was on the right side. It's on the wrong side for you guys. Yo, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Fine. Unfortunately, the cockpit that got destroyed had all the hotkey set up. <laughs> <laughs> this one doesn't. It's just a passenger seat. So the one that you were driving in, it shot it completely off then. Yeah. <laughs> so the laser turret doesn't like you. Uh, apparently. <laughs> Unless it was trying to shoot something else, and I just happened to be in the way, which it's True. quite possible. True. <laughs> quite possible. Well, it looks like a... At least a smoking doom bug, you know? Yeah, and I don't even have the exhaust pipe set up either. <laughs> Here we go. Rafter burner! <laughs> when you come up here next, I'll show you. Yes. <laughs> Well, it's gonna go faster if you come down here and... Well, I can't drive drive it down there, though. <laughs> True. But I meant come down here and pick up some titanium. Fire and smoke small. Sorry, I, I, I was kind of fixing the vehicle after your vehicle <laughs> took a, took exception to it. <laughs> Not my fault. <laughs> You probably said something bad to your laser. Sure. Uh, we'll go with that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm coming down. <laughs> you just wanted to park nearby, but your laser was like, Zorp! <laughs> 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 you got too close. Yeah. Apparently. Apparently. I need to check the distance <laughs> when it's gonna start shooting. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 
You lose it loose you in with false uh, safety. <laughs> yeah. Like hiya friend, how you doing? Oh, I don't like what's on your vehicle. <laughs> 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 <Damn> it. <laughs> I have full inventory for you. Here you go. <laughs> That's a uh, large patch of titanium. Oh yeah, it's a huge Where's patch of silicon. Is it silicon or titanium? Uh, we're at the titanium. I don't know where okay. you are. Spectator. Yeah, we're at titanium. Yeah. Purely titanium. Very deep. It takes like a marathon to get out of it every time. His walking is slow. We don't have jetpacks, so... Okay, we have a lot of titanium already. I think we could probably safely head back. Are you sure? Yeah, we have like 50 to 60k titanium. Yeah, 70k titanium, give or take. Oh. I think <laughs> Oh, yeah. make that about 100k titanium. Uh, 125 then. Yeah, you weren't kidding about your rover being absorbed. Yeah, it got absorbed. <laughs> it's fine, it's drivable. Now. <laughs> <laughs> you only... just needed a bit of makeover. Yeah, I only had to tear it down every single pl <laughs> possible block that had any semblance of a display in it. <laughs> okay, let's trip down and then I'm gonna go back to base. Get one inventory full and then. Yeah, and then head back. Uh, you want me to, like, <laughs> drag your vehicle back? No, it's, it's fine. It's still got plenty of hydrogen and the batteries are still fairly full. But your plane? Yeah, the plane I can get back in any time. Well, I guess we could go back to the, uh, the outpost because we're going to be going right past it, right? Yeah. Then so we'll hook a hinge. <laughs> a hinge, a rotor. Um, maybe another hinge? You just need two hinges. Well, a rotor also. Yeah, yeah. You're right. The rotor hinge hinge. Alright. Where's the way out? There. I'm full enough. <laughs> Grab the stragglers. And the marathon up. Yeah. <laughs> Normally I cut out all the mining stuff. I probably will do here too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't think it's so interesting running down and up. <laughs> no. Maybe once and then <laughs> that's not no it more. <laughs> oh, you have a hinge there, so we need a rotor. I have a hinge part here. Uh, slap in your titanium into the other to the right one. So it's oh, I've already out there. I've already Pass it in. Oh, I will. I need to even it out a bit more. Oh yeah, fire! 
Got some marshmallows? <laughs> yeah, that's enough. Uh, I think we need to go to the other base to get materials for a rotor. For the hinge, yeah. There should be yeah. parts there for that. Hinge I have enough, but I don't know if I have a rotor. Fire and smoke small. Now I got a I'm on front wheel right now. Rear wheel on Do front not wheel. Turn on the turret. Okay, I guess one of my batteries got torched. <laughs> I wonder how. Or it might be because of, uh... Okay, there we go. I'm on rear wheel, rear wheel drive right now. <laughs> Maybe need a bit more strength into these wheels. <laughs> now that I'm fully loaded. Oh, did my gyroscope get... Uh, you might have parts for a gyroscope, uh, if, if my gyroscope got torched. No, I got a gyroscope. Okay, good. Whew. I was concerned there. Because <laughs> jumping dunes is all fine and dandy. Unless you have no gyroscope, then you're pretty screwed. Yeah. I think it's a bit more popular. where I got out of the canyon. That's a huge jump, by the way. Thank goodness for gyroscopes. Thank goodness for your bump bar on this one. <laughs> oh, the front bumper? Yeah, I just... Uh, a rock just bound in in front oh. of me. <laughs> No, no, no. Oh. Um. I'm here. I may have flipped. Give me a moment to yes. get sorted. <laughs> I have steel plates if you need to make a... Wrong one. Crack bar. Well, I'm gonna back off a bit. What? Get up there. <laughs> Nothing damaged. <laughs> I kind of just took a turn a little too fast. Don't roll. Nope. Save it. Oh. 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 Yes. Back on its wheels. <laughs> Saved it. I think it saved itself. <laughs> <laughs> I'm almost at the outpost. Me too. I'm currently behind you. Nope. I'm flying. Oh, well, I didn't need that hydrogen engine and everything attached to it anyway. What? <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> Did you lost your whole rear end? I still have a hydrogen tank. Where the hell are you? <laughs> <laughs> Fine, I still have enough power. 
I'm only running on batteries right now, anyway. Slowly backing back. Let's see where you are. <laughs> nope, I'm on my way. <laughs> ah, there you are. Good news, my plane's done. Bad news, it's loud. Propellers? Yeah. Yeah. Propellers are loud. Well. It... We. <laughs> <laughs> Even my vehicle can jump quite good. There's a hole. Whoa. Okay, so I lost a hydrogen engine, which isn't too bad because I was probably going to replace it with a gas engine eventually anyway. You lost half the car. <laughs> Laser zapped me. Don't oh, worry, we're still driving half a car. Let's see how I'm going to tow this one. What was, what was that? Hyphen. Okay. Hyphen fell off my vehicle. <laughs> I should really get some backing lights. This one. Probably wouldn't be a bad idea. Especially when you're straight behind me. Actually, I'll Could I get GPS? Yes. Where you guys are. Yep. Did you post it, Bane? Okay, so, so put a rotor in between, I get, um... Yeah. Oh, hold on. What? I gotta change this to go the other way. Because you gotta put a rotor and then you gotta put a hinge and then... Should be able to connect it. components for it? No, we don't have the wires. For the rotor? Yeah. So we need uh, more construction components. I got them. I have parts here. Because there's, some, there's some wind turbines and there's some batteries and stuff like that in here. Yep, yeah, we only need copper wire. Right. And a whole bunch of miscellaneous hinge parts in here. <coughs> oh, right, we can just tear them down. None of them have copper wires in them. True. This door doesn't have copper wires in it. But the wind the turrets turbine don't. Have. Well, the turrets did have copper wires in it. How did we shut them? Oh, this door have. I have four. I think I need five. Yes, I need five. I need one more. 
Oh, there should be two doors here. Oh, you already used one of the doors. Alright, on the other base. Glasses. Okay. Aluminum plate. No. Okay. This is a turbine. I got four here. slots in perfectly. Okay, you can attach. Uh, wait, I need to find the right one. And... There we go. Yeah. And then we do... And now turn the wheels off. No torque at all. Right? Yeah, no torque. Or the lowest torque that they can have. You might want to set the uh, uh, the rotation to maybe plus minus fifteen. Uh, yeah, rotor. Yeah, upper limit fifteen. I can't set it to 15. Oh, right. There we go. Upper limit 15, lower limit 15. Um. Minus 15. Yeah. There we go. And that should give a little bit of uh, articulation, though it seems you've gone a little too high there. What? Is the rotor set to? Oh, because the center point is 270. Oh. So you have to bring it down to, say, 225? Yeah. I don't want it to flip around. And. and. Uh, what is this? And 315. According like to what this this rotor is telling me, up is two seventy. It's up two seventy. Yeah, up is two seventy. So two twenty five for the low and three fifteen for the high. Yeah, it's done. Uh, should I uh, remove the torque also, or just have the torque on? Just turn the block off. Block off. Oh no, lower limit 225 plus 225. What? Plus, yep. tw plus 225. Okay. Because up is 270 plus 270. No. Apparently not. Did anything else get broken? Not from my view. Where the is. hell am I? Oh, guess where <laughs> I am? I'm at the Pilgrim. <laughs> where the hell did your body fly? Here. Uh, let me reload that because something went a little funky. Oh, you took out a propeller too. <laughs> it's interesting. Mm. 
Just looking at it. <laughs> okay, so I think that was very, uh, um, weird. <laughs> useful, uh, very productive. There we are, productive. Because we got a bunch of titanium, we got a new vehicle, yeah. Atomic built a plane. What? Ignore oh, that. <clears throat> and I gotta hook this ro this rover up to uh, some some sort of power source here. Uh, and yeah. Charge it up. Is this a fix? Yeah, it is. Uh, yes. Part for it. Fuel, I just need to put another rotor down here. Mm -hmm. There we go. Or another hinge. I just need to go. Yeah. Wait. I'm gonna. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> that's gonna be it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. Please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. You know, that kind of junk, right? And uh, we will see you guys in the next one. Maybe Atomic's plane will actually fly more than it did this time. This thing looks bulky. Super bulky, man. <laughs> he didn't like that I called his plane bulky. <laughs> anyway until next time i've been relaxed gamer oh that's vain and atomics the one that always kills me we will see you guys in the next one ciao